This is Randy Bale from All Sports Scoreboards again. As I'd like to show you a couple of different fully matrix scoreboards um, and a comparison between a matrix scoreboard setup, which runs a synchronous system, compared to um, over here, which is actually a billboard, which runs an asynchronous system here. Okay. Essentially, the difference between the two of them is that an asynchronous system is actually set up running from a computer. You load your information in on the graphics. The graphics is actually sent to the actual control card. And the control card plays those graphics and text or whatever you put on the screen until the next time you load up the graphic card, okay? So what you can do when you send the information to it, if you have a, a, an LED billboard out front or for, uh, for your school or for your um, club or whatever else, or just an independent billboard, you send that data information across to it, it stays on there, and you can turn your computer off of whatever your data is actually stored on until the next time it's actually ready to send information. Okay, you send information back to it again, and then it will upload the new information in text. And as you can see, you can put all kinds of different text and graphics, static images, or anything on these. Anything that you can actually show on a display um, for your computer, you can actually put on your full, um, on your full uh, billboard set up outside. Okay, and they're made to live outside and to run 24-7. And you can also program it to turn on and turn off. So in the morning, it can turn on at 7 o'clock at first light. It can turn off at 10 o'clock, or whatever your council ordinance are specified. Difference between that one, which is a P16 matrix, and over here, which is a scoreboard setup, the same P16 matrix, also a full color display, is that this is what's called a synchronous system. Synchronous system is connected to your computer at all times because essentially you're updating information, data, and whatnot to it all the time. So you can see, I'm running this way. We have it set up for a basic scoreboard here. Okay, so it actually has a game clock that we have set up, two score names, and we got the scores set up on the side. The game clock will set up, it'll run down, the um, side of sound, we can also do a synchronous time program as well, so we can have a timing program so we can play all day, and you can just update your scores. But what the, what's good about this one too, is as it's playing the scores throughout the day, you can also just have different types of videos that you can actually load in and play. Now this might be a bit bright, but you see this is just the video element that we've actually put on there. That'll go and play in between your scores, so you can show a sponsor ad or whatever. Um, when you stop that, it goes straight back onto your scores. It's a really good thing with versatility and with live feed. Um, also, in addition to this, you can also um, put some scrolling text messages on it. So you can see, just you know, we just put a random text message across here, and you can well, take it scroll across at any random time that you actually select it, and you can put all kinds of text details in there. When you stop that information, it will go back to the score. And you can see a very simple setup. The difference between the two of them, like it says, is the um, this one is connected to your computer at all times, whereas the other one, it doesn't have to be connected to the computer at all. You can turn your computer off and leave it. Okay? It's just the live updates, your live video feed, so you can actually hook up an AV camera directly to it. You can take a video of what's happening, you can show it straight onto the screen. Okay? So it's, you get your live scoreboard elements as opposed to just your um, billboard information. Both the setups are for these two right here, P16, which is a 16 millimeter pixel pitch. The pixel pitch is your distance between a cluster of LEDs, which is a red, green, and a blue um, cluster of LEDs, to the next cluster of LEDs, both vertically and horizontally, which is a 16 mm pitch. This is made to live outside. It's all wide angle viewing. All the LEDs have covers on it for the rain. All of them have fans inside it. It's going to live outside, run 24 7 if you want to set up to. Um, these can be used for live concerts, whatever else. They break down into different module sizes. So this scoreboard here to the size of this right now, which I believe is 3.6 by 1.6, I think, um, or by 1.8, um, it actually breaks down into smaller cabinets. And these cabinets then get put together to make one large scoreboard. So you can add on to it at future times to make it larger. Um, and you can also have these be mountable, so you can actually remove them from place to place and utilize them in different locations. Anyway, there's a lot more information on it. Um, we custom make them. Um, for any, anybody, for any size, they can be indoor as well as outdoor. Um, the pixel pitch matrices go as low as a 6 mil if you wanted to, but up to a 35 mil pixel pitch. Um, and remember that the larger your pixel pitch, the larger your text is, the smaller your pixel pitch, the finer the resolution of your video is. Um, that's pretty much it. Contact me for more information because there's a lot more information and we quote every um, project to actually suit. So um, I'm Randy Bailey from All Sports Scoreboards. Hop online at www.allsportscoreboards.com. For at electronicdisplays.com, and we can help you out and find the right solution for either your sport or for your business, whether you want to have a live connection or one you just update your information to.